We have a ways to go before summer, but when it gets here, you can expect festivals, fairs, and food trucks. But there are now new regulations for food truck owners and wheeling to operate. News 9's Gage Golding has our story. In the summertime, Center Market here in Wheeling can become a very happening place. But thanks to new ordinance here in the city of Wheeling, food truck owners might not get their fair share of that business. This past fall, uh, there were a couple of restaurants that expressed concern about food trucks setting up in front of their establishments. So at last week's Wheeling City Council meeting, elected officials amended the food truck ordinance to restrict trucks from operating within 100 feet of a brick and mortar restaurant establishment. The main area of complaint also happens to be the area where food trucks want to go. All of the food truck permits that have been issued since the ordinance was enacted or have been in the center market area. So we reached out to a local food truck owner, Christopher Burris, the owner of Tito's Sloppy Dogs. He has taken his truck down to center market. It's worth it. I like doing it. Burris also sees the other side of things as well. He has a restaurant located on Market Street in downtown Wheeling. So if, so if a food truck pulled up right in front of my place, I would be upset, but I also have a food truck too. And he's had the situation happen before, actually many times before, but he thinks there's something that helped him through. I had the cheese mold across from me for two years and my business was still good because I have good food. City manager Heron saying that Wheeling is not trying to take business away from food trucks, but rather come to a compromise. The current city council uh, enacted a food truck ordinance. Prior to that, food trucks were not permitted on the public right of way. Now, city manager Robert Heron did tell me that several city council members did express interest in reducing that radius from 100 feet to about 25 or 50 feet. That will be discussed and proposed in the next Wheeling City Council meeting. Reporting in Center Market for News 9, I'm Gage Golding.